gentleman from Illinois is recognized for one minute. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman, and I certainly appreciate my, my friend and colleague from New Jersey yielding me some time. And today I rise in strong support of this bipartisan amendment. Since 1964, the Land and Water Conservation Fund has been our nation's primary program for federal land conservation. Using a portion of the leases collected from energy production on the Outer Continental Shelf, this funding provides matching grants to state and local governments for the acquisition of land and ensures public land and water conservation products, projects can move forward. In my home state of Illinois, the economic benefits of preserved public lands are indeed undeniable. Sportsmen, wildlife watchers, outdoorsmen, and other combined to spend over $2 billion annually on outdoor recreation in Illinois. Mr. Chairman, our amendment today is simple. We believe that this Congress should continue its commitment to conservation programs by ensuring that the underlying transportation bill will not reduce the amount of revenue available for the Land and Water Conservation Fund that has supported over 41,000 state and local projects over its 46-year history. And with that, I yield back my time, and I thank the gentleman for yielding. I gentlemen, to reserve my time. Gentlemen.